Good morning. I want to tell you about something that happened with two dogs that I know. I was pleasantly surprised that our dog Tanner got along with our daughter and son-in-law's dog, Willow. Willow came to visit for a few days. The reason I was surprised is because a couple of weeks ago, the two dogs got into a fight. I know this sometimes happens with animals when food or a toy is involved. They both want it and there's no backing down. Anyway, fortunately, both dogs were okay. Although Tanner, the smaller dog, sulked a little bit afterwards. So it was with some hesitation that we brought the dogs together when our daughter came to visit. Willow was eager to see us and seemed to have forgotten any problem with Tanner. For his part, Tanner seemed to be okay too. They played some, ran around the backyard together, and then rested nearby each other when they came inside. It made me think about people and the fights or conflicts that we might have. Usually they're not physical altercations and that's good. However, we might have verbal conflicts and arguments. They can be hard to recover from and we might need help. But it can be such a blessing when these conflicts are worked through and resolved. This is when the love and the grace of God can really make a difference for us when we have a disagreement with family, friends, or others who we may not even know that well. Of course, Jesus faced conflict in his time on earth. He encouraged his followers to be peacemakers. Blessed are the peacemakers for they will be called children of God. Matthew 5, 9. Thank you for all you do to help resolve conflict and bring peace. It's not easy. But with the Lord working along with our efforts, blessings will come forth. Let's pray. Thank you, dear Lord, for working with us to resolve differences and bring peace. May we look to you when the way gets difficult and share your love and compassion with others. In Jesus' name, amen. Have a great day.